Let's get right to it. If you aren't in a shortcut role, you're starting from scratch. There are very few shortcut roles. The data analyst is a shortcut role, so is the DBA, and so is the Python developer. The truth is, without heavy data skills, you're likely starting from scratch. People will often ask me, what about this role or that role? What makes one a shortcut role and one not? The answer is data. All machine learning models are built with data. Most machine learning models in the real world are regression and classification on structured data. The data is housed in databases. Some of these are housed in relational data stores, some in data warehouses, but all of them in structured data stores. How can you tell if you're in a shortcut role? Do you know SQL and how well do you know it? If you have SQL experience and you can get past the SQL technical interview, then you're ahead of the game. If you don't have strong SQL skills, you're likely starting from scratch. Countless surveys on applied machine learning show that 80% of the work of a machine learning engineer is data-centric. That means you're going to be spending most of your time writing queries to extract the data you need and then applying statistical techniques to your data to clean that data. Data skills are the holy grail in machine learning. The only other shortcut role I can think of is the Python programmer. Why? Because data cleaning and modeling is mostly Python. If you have that in your resume and you know Python, then you're ahead of the game. The truth is, most people don't have real-world data experience, and that means, regardless of the role you're in right now, you're likely starting from scratch. Now, what does that mean for you? It simply means you're going to need to start in a more entry-level role. The truth is, machine learning is one of the hardest roles to attain, and companies aren't hiring machine learning engineers that don't have real-world data experience. If you can't source and clean your own data, you can't do 80% of the job, and companies don't want you. My advice, learn SQL, attain a role working with data as soon as possible. The more data experience you have, the faster you can start focusing on the other aspects of machine learning, like modeling. Now, if you have solid SQL skills, the next step is data cleansing. Data cleansing skills are the unsung hero of machine learning. The better you are at cleansing data, the better your model's results are going to be. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a great day.